President Biden faces a crucial week as Title 42 ends as his administration is prepared for what comes next. With time running out, can he negotiate with Republicans to keep America from defaulting on its bills? NBC's Chris Pallone is live on Capitol Hill with details on a very important week coming up. Chris, good morning. Maureen, good morning to you. The situation on the southern border appears to have stabilized somewhat, but now there's a deadline which could see the nation default on its debts quickly approaching. Negotiations are underway, but with President Biden set to go to Asia this week, the time for a deal is quickly running out. During a break in his Sunday afternoon bike ride, President Biden said he's confident Democrats and Republicans will be able to resolve a debt limit crisis before the nation plunges into default. I really think there's a desire on their part as well as ours to reach agreement. I think we'll be able to do it. The Treasury says the nation could run out of money to pay past expenses as early as June 1st. Republicans want budget cuts as a condition to raise the limit. We are reasonable, say we're willing to raise the debt ceiling. But we want meaningful spending cuts and capping spending at 2022 levels. But some Democrats accuse GOP hardliners of holding the U.S. economy hostage to get their way. The president has been clear that he is prepared to begin a separate discussion about budget and spending priorities, um, but not under the threat of default. Defaulting on the debt would be catastrophic. It would send a, a chain of reaction of events across the country that would really freeze everything up. It, it would be terrible. While the debt limit deadline is on the horizon, the White House continues to deal with the fallout from last week's shift in immigration policy. Thousands of migrants flooded border towns ahead of the end of a key pandemic era rule. Now lawmakers will see if there's any appetite on Capitol Hill to enact real immigration reform in its wake. When it comes to negotiations with the Democrats uh, on, on this policy, I say to them very clearly, so let's secure the border first. Let's get it done. Since Rule 42 ended, the number of migrants caught crossing the border dropped more than 50 percent from earlier in the week. President Biden is scheduled to go to the G7 summit in Asia on Wednesday. He says he still plans to go even if a debt limit deal is not reached by then. Aides will negotiate in his absence and keep him apprised of the progress. Maureen, back to you. And Chris, we know the aides will continue to negotiate, but do we have any idea when the president and the speaker will talk face to face? It looks like that might happen tomorrow. The president said uh, during a brief meeting with reporters yesterday that he does plan to meet with Speaker McCarthy before he goes to Asia. The most likely date is tomorrow. A meeting that was originally scheduled for Friday was canceled to allow more to be hashed out behind the scenes. So we'll keep an eye and see if something is formally scheduled later on today. All right, Chris Pallone, live for us in Washington, D.C. Thank you so much for the update. We'll be following it.